Hi guys, happy Vlogmas day four. Today I am going to be trying this drink that we found at the grocery store it's called So Delicious Dairy Free Coconut Seasonal Beverage Holiday Nog. <laughs> so I assume it is some type of eggnog. I grew up drinking eggnog at Christmas time, so I'm very used to it. Tony didn't grow up on it, so he doesn't like it. Did you already open this, babe? No. It's open. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. Should we still drink it? I'm just disturbed now. No, don't. No. But what about my eggnog now? What the I'm gonna drink fuck? it in my Christmas cup. Did you open? No, I didn't do anything. Like, I opened oh, what that. The yeah. I'm kind of like annoyed now. We need to go back to the grocery store and get a not opened eggnog container. My husband is great driving me back to the grocery store he could have just said go yourself <laughs> like go yourself to the grocery store not go blank yourself he could have said that too <laughs> from the grocery store and now we will see if in fact the seal was even broken same thing. <laughs> we are now not even sure if that was all necessary. I will show you what I saw. Like usually when you open juice, do you see there's another like layer under there? So usually when you open juice, you open the cap and then you have to open that second layer. But this one, the cap was like sealed on, but it's still open within. So I now don't even know if that was like necessary or not. And I feel kind of yeah. bad. I heard you're supposed to have eggnog with rum. I have my Bacardi rum here. And I have a Christmas cup that I got last year from Walmart. I am not sure if this is meant to be drank cold or hot. I'm probably gonna have it hot, but I will try it cold first. So again, we have our holiday coconut, coconut holiday nog, dairy free. So to me, it tastes exactly like eggnog. <laughs> I like that it already comes with the nutmeg. I can taste it in there. As for coconut, I'm not getting any coconut. I'm just getting pure eggnog. So I'm going to microwave this, add some rum and see how that is. I've never had eggnog with rum before. I usually just have it pure. I will be right back. I microwaved my eggnog. Let's add some of the rum. I don't know how much to add. I'm gonna add like a tablespoon type of amount. We can always add more if we need to. The internet also said you can put whipped cream on the top to have your traditional rum and eggnog. <sighs> That's really good. <laughs> Let's have Tony try. <laughs> but I'm eating already. I'm eating summer sausage and bread. Okay, finish your sauce. So oh, this is dangerous. I can't pour very well. Okay, okay. Yes, fuck. Mm. It's really good. I it's really, pretty good. <laughs> it's really good with the rub. When you're cold and you want to sit in and be warm with a blanket, this will spice you up. Mm. Yay! Cheers! That's it for Vlogmas Day 4, where we had possibly unnecessary eggnog drama. Goodbye!